Hey, 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 this is Kurt the Boat Doctor. Down here at the bay, hey. This is a nice day. I've been lucky so far. They called for rain for the last five days. It started to sprinkle, but here I am, boat doctor. Mm-hmm. Oh, it's a beautiful trailer, nice, painted. Uh, it's a 15 resorter, smoker craft, 2023. I like the color. Two-inch ball, chains, flat four on the wires. Uh, you got these here can come undone. You can move it up here. I kind of like side consoles better than I do centers. You even got a cup holder there, storage here, live well here, fish box. <laughs> right there, pole holder. The reason why I like side consoles, if I take that seat out, I can put it there, I can put it there, I can put it back there. I can add as another seat to have three seats, put it up here. But if you take that seat out, say you're by yourself, you can fish this whole boat. Walk up here, reach over and steer it. Uh, nothing's in your way or you could take that seat move it back over there or leave it up front and then it would give you someone could ride back there if they wanted to or and you'd still have a lot of fish room like you could move that seat back there and then you'd be staggered so everybody could move around cup holders carpet for a nice finishing touch inline four cylinder 50 horse Yamaha and Merck's got the power because they're a four cylinder versus a three step little trim tabs they put on there screen that's for your live well drain plug that other one's for a drain for the live well <clears throat> so your oil drains right here your you put uh, put your earmuffs or flushers right there you take put water to it then start the motor then turn the motor off then turn the water off always have water going to that and always have the motor trimmed down like that and again if your battery went dead right in there right there flat head counter clockwise and it relieves the press pressure on this trim pump uh, so you can lift it up and then tighten it down and then put it on these right here just say it happened get some corrosion x spray it on this don't grease this uh, stuff will stick to it and water will stick to it and then you'll have a frozen steering tube corrosion x prevents that same thing with spraying your motor down once a year completely with corrosion x is a good idea uh, stainless prop shaft, drive shaft, two coats of clear, two coats of primer. Uh, so corrosion X, uh, going back to that again. If you start, like even here, someone put a, like a nut right there. This will come out, but if you happen to see that, just spray that corrosion X and that will eat that up. Spray those things down, keeps the uh, corrosion from building up. Uh, you got five lug, galvanized, load guides. Nice little boats, actually. Um, you know, bang for the buck, you can't beat it. Got tag, got speedometer, got a horn. What more could he ask for? Cleats, my God, they put cleats where they belong. All right, we'll see on the water. Uh, so far, so good. I put in four gallons of uh, non-ethanol. These will run forever on three gallons, by the way. And uh, it's got a portable tank and battery. And you got the 10 micron Yamaha fuel filter. Change that once a year and stick with Yamaha. Okay, this is the boat doctor. Eep, eep, Yamaha, eep, that's how, you see, I don't, actually, I should have a bigger one. It only goes to 32, uh, you know, say 32, maybe 36, seven inch. I, the ones I catch are 42 plus, you know, but you know, yeah, that's a mini one for me. That's a joke, okay? Boat doctor out.